Hey guys, this is Julia Bell from independencejewelry.com with another how-to video. Today we are wire wrapping sea glass into a pendant like this. I'm on a Lake Erie beach south of Buffalo, New York. This is one of the best places to look for sea glass. And this is how I got started in wire wrapping. I would find like really cool pieces on the beach and I wanted to do something with them. So I taught myself how to wire wrap and I want to show you how to do it too. Check out how much sea glass I found on my walk today. To start this project, cut four eight inch lengths of 22 gauge round wire and another eight inch length of 22 gauge half round wire and start wrapping the wires together. I'm going with four wraps and tucking the ends on one side. Make two of these wire wrap sections. Grab your chain nose pliers and bend a 90 degree angle in the middle of the two sections. Make sure the tucked in ends are on the inside of the angle. This technique is excellent for pieces that have a sharp point on the bottom. So grab your piece of sea glass and fit it into your 90 degree angle you just made and squeeze the rest of the wire around the piece of sea glass. Starting with the back side of the sea glass, bend the wires over the glass near the wire wrap section. Let go of the piece of sea glass so you can get your chain nose pliers in to make more bends. To secure the glass into the frame, make 120 degree angle bends on both sides and straighten the wire. I like to bend the angles slightly outward so the glass sinks in. Place the glass into the frame and determine where to bend the wire to match up with the original wires. Bend the wires parallel and place the glass back into the frame. It should sit into the frame easily. Bend the top wires over the front of the pendant, alternating sides in a weaving pattern. Secure the back of the frame by threading the 22 gauge half round wire onto the bottom two wires. Make three wraps on both sides. Now, bend the two pairs of wrapped wires over the top of the pendant and make a 90 degree angle with your chain nose pliers. Do this for both sides. You want these four wires to match and point straight up. Now grab the first wire in the weave on the front and start wrapping around the four wires tightly. This first wrap is very important since it tightens the entire frame around your piece of sea glass. Continue wrapping each wire alternating sides. Follow along with your weave pattern. Cut and tuck in each wire making sure there are no ends sticking out. Use your chain nose pliers to flatten the four wires. This will be your bail. You want these as straight as possible. Bend the wires up to a 120 degree angle. Then use your round nose pliers and bend back and around to form the bail. Take the topmost wire and bend it around to the other side. I'm going to turn these ends into accent spirals. Determine the length you want your spirals to be and make your cuts. Use your chain nose pliers for assistance. Use the natural shape of the stone to determine what would look best for you. When you're done wrapping your spirals, use the side of your chain nose pliers to press them in. And this wrap is done. What is your favorite color of beach glass? Let me know in the comments below. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. It really helps me out. Your support helps me make more videos. So thanks for watching everyone.